And I want you to get on that right away. Thank you. Good. All right. I've got the whole law firm on it. Yeah, she keeps the whole law firm on retainer. <laughs> you never know when you're going to go on trial for murder. Really? Addie! Uh, she, <laughs> what she means is, you know, it, it pays to be prepared. Thank you. Thank you very much. You're quite welcome. Now, let me uh, fix you a plate of food. Can you save it for me? I want to tell Christian and Vanessa that they don't have to pay any more money to lawyers. We'll come with you. Well, let's go. Well, uh, uh, of course. That's right, Addie. You, you, you go sit down. Um. Aren't you going to eat? It's a very nice thing that you did for Lola. Don't sound so surprised. Well, I'm not. I know you have a very generous heart. Thank you. Which is why I want you to apologize to Marty. Well? Well, what? Are you going to apologize to Marty and John? For what? Doing my duty as the head of this family? Oh, come on. Other than reminding us about a thousand times a day that we're Kramer women, what else does that operation entail? Hmm? You may scoff if you wish, but believe me, it's no easy task. Oh, Dorian, look, I know that you love us. I know you care about us, but you're interfering, okay? You're interfering with John and me. You hired a, a hitman to go after Langston's shh, uncle. Shh, she knows, okay? You also paid off a very messed up soldier to interrupt Adriana's wedding. Did you or did you not? Okay, you're right. I do interfere. Ah, oh, finally. But it is only because I love you. I love all of you. And I have the big picture in mind. Who was it who stood up for you, who stood up to Todd when he was ruling this house by martial law? I appreciate everything that you have done for me, but you are not my mother. I might as well be. I am in the room. Claire. Do you deny that you came to me to discuss your problems with John? Hmm? Yeah, I deny it, because I didn't. You forced me to have that conversation. We were sitting right there. And I didn't ask you to confront John and Marty. All I did was ask a few simple questions. In a restaurant full of people. Oh, I don't care. I don't care about Marty. I don't care about her at all, or John. All I care about is you. Do you understand me? Because you're my niece. And because I love you. And I always will. That is never going to change. So you just better learn to live with it. OK, Nora. Thanks. So, so what'd she say? Did she find out when immigration is coming? Vanessa? Lola! <laughs> Everything is going to be okay. So what's this good news that you couldn't tell me on the phone? Langston's mother, she has a ton of lawyers, and she's gonna help us stay here. But did you ask her to do this? No, she offered. You stopped Ray from taking me to Colombia, Lola, too. Uh, she was worried about you guys going back there. Well, you know, please thank her, but, but this is too much. No, 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 that's just Dorian Lord. Too much is kind of her trademark. She's got good timing, too. Nora found out when immigration's coming next week. So if Dorian's people are gonna come through, we're going to have to hurry. Look, I know that you love me, Dorian. And I know that you know what a difficult time I've had lately. And I know you were just trying to make something go right for me. So you do understand? Yes, I do. And Todd always thought that he was trying to help. Oh, don't you compare me to your evil ex-husband. Well, then you stop acting like him. If you really want to help me, you will apologize to Marty and to John. No, I will not. Surprise, surprise. I know you mean well. Blair knows it, too. She's, she's just not ready to be wrong yet. <laughs> 